Nick Knowles was part of a huge team of TV and radio personalities to help a support group for young women. The presenting legend, alongside a whole host of Radio 2 presenters all chipped in to help the lives of the community called the Getaway Girls. The show was part of a BBC Children in Need special which led to emotional scenes among viewers and presenters alike. The popular team, famed for renovating a new home or property, took on the task of rebuilding the home of Leeds Getaway Girls. At the end of the successful build, the group of girls performed a rendition of their own song as all the volunteers and DIY SOS crew took time to reflect on their efforts. Closing the show, long-running presenter Nick summarized the efforts of the latest team. He said over the last 35 years Getaway Girls has been making sure that young women in this area feel empowered and safe. But there was such a need for the work they did, that they had outgrown their premises and there was no way that they could find new premises. Well that was until all this lot turned up. It's important our young people feel empowered and safe, maybe Terry's someone you can help. After explaining the details of how to donate to the Children in Need Fund, the presenter declared, Thank you, I am off for a little cry now. Viewers of the show were equally teary-eyed at the story of the charity and flocked to social media to share their feelings. At Volunteer Brett tweeted, Inspiring. Emotional and going to make such a difference. Uplifting Tully at its finest. At Logan Berry 09 Bend, cried throughout that hashtag Daisos, again. Nothing like a wonderful group of people coming together for the greater good, and reinforce a bit of faith in humanity. Such great TV, too. Well done, everyone. At Wendy Cherries added, I was hanging in there until you started. At Sharon White wrote, at Getaway Girls he felt VV proud and emotional to see her and your amazing service still leading your incredible service. Thank you. At Sertza remarked, DIY SOS Getaway Girls wow, wow, wow. What an emotional roller coaster. Blown away by what I have just watched. Safe spaces for our young people, boys or girls, are needed in all cities. Nice to see a WD update involved. Nice one. James Brooks agreed and wrote, Yup, you got me again, what an amazing project for a worthy cause, the girls choir and that song got me going, and the reveal just about finished me off. Thank you to everyone who worked so hard, brilliant. Nick, who's recently starred on Channel 5, enlisted the help of BBC Radio 2 Scott Mills, Zoe Ball, Ryland Clark and the legendary host Ken Bruce for his latest project. The huge project to create a brand new building took place over 10 days, with over 200 volunteers including the celebrities contributing to 200,000 hours of labor. Nick has presented DIY SOS for over 20 years and has often been faced with heartbreaking stories. He told BBC Breakfast how he deals with working on the show earlier this year, he said, first of all it's hugely reassuring when you see the fortitude of people and what they deal with on a day-to-day -day basis. You tend to go, well it might be tough on me, but I'm not living what they're living so I can't really fall apart. The charity ambassador added, there's no doubt that a number of the crew end up pulling over into Labies on the way home to have a little cry for a little while to deal with everything you process in such a short time. Children in Need airs this Friday from 7pm on BBC One and BBC iPlayer.